Hello everyone, this is King Kong LT. This video I will show you how to use this web page to control output on and off. I will also use this H32BS and also you can use H32B or other channel words or this part. You can see I can use this website and you can click uh, this on and off. On, turn on every relay independently and I can turn on off. And also I can turn on, on and off. So this is countering by the web page, that is by the HTTP command. Uh, this command uh, you can log in by the website. Uh, this is the controller website. Also, you can send this HTTP command by your own software print for. Now I will tell you how to do with it, uh, send command. Before we can send command, uh, you can see uh, here is our some settings you need to understand uh, the password. Uh, this is the login password and this is the post post password uh, what's this different password means the login password that means when you open this you can see i open this web browser and import the ip of the controller and you will see as uh, this a username and the password and the username always admin this username admin and uh, not this one, not this one. Uh, the password uh, is this one, login password. So this we can input the admin. This admin is this admin. Okay, you can set by yourself uh, for the password. And now you can just login uh, for country the output uh, for every channel. And also you will see this is a post password that you can also define by yourself. This post password is used for HTTP command. Now we can see what is the HTTP command. You can open Kinkoni website and press the service software and the document and you will see this web page and just scroll up. And you will see uh, this HTTP because this HTTP command is, is seen, as seen as a HTTPS or other channel words. So we can just click and open this PDF file and you will see uh, this is H32B BS controller HTTP command uh, the first one is the read release state uh, just you can send this command very easy uh, you will feedback uh, all the relay output is on and off I uh, just will feedback the 32 channel feedback and if you use 16 channel version just uh, feedback 16 channel the relay state and also you can turn on and turn off every relay uh, just like send this command and uh, you can also read the input part state uh, that you can read the sensor state by the HTTP command so this three command uh, is very easy now I will tell you how to use this three command because this can integrate uh, your own software I have copied this three command uh, to this uh, notepad I just read and uh, turn on off and read input. So the first you just need to change the IP address of your country IP address. Uh, this needed to change and this not needed to change. And this is command is fixed. Uh, this is read. RD means read. And uh, you can see I have never changed. And this is the post password. This post password is 12345. So you can see uh, this is the post password. So the HTTP command, uh, the password, just replace with this one set by yourself. So if you send this command in your web browser, you will read the state of your uh, every output. You can see I can copy and this address I can paste, paste, you can enter. And you will see uh, this is 32 channel output. Uh, it's very long now just every is button one is off button two is off this button just means really output off if i can turn on turn on the full relay output uh, you can see the full relay is output i can refresh i just send this command again refresh uh, you can see a uh, button one is on two is on three is on four is on and the late channel output all is off so this can read all channel output uh, by one command 
you can just decode the feedback uh, for your function you can to use. And now I will tell you the second, uh, how to turn on one relay on and off. If you want to turn on relay one, so you can just also replace the IP address and the relay number is on. That is, the, you can see the red one. Relay one is on. And if you want to relay two, just change 0, 2, or 0, 3. Uh, this is 30. So if you want on, just press on. If you want off, just press the off. And also the password is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So you can copy this command and uh, paste paste in your web browser and enter okay you can see this relay is on and also it will feedback all channels output state uh, now the relay is on and if you want to turn off the relay you just change this this stream just on is off and now you can enter so you can see the feedback is off and also you can see this relay output one is off so this is how to turn on and turn off relay by your command. It's very easy. And the third, you can read the input state. The blue one is input state of the sensor. So you can see I can copy this command and uh, to the web browser address. I can press. You can see the input 1 is yellow, input 2 is yellow, 3 is yellow, all is yellow. This is 6 channel input part for this uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. You can see if I have used this line, uh, this is ground, I can triangle the number 1, uh, input 1. You can see I can let it shut for input 1. Uh, this is, I have uh, set the sense mode uh, for the last video. No problem, we can see. Now I refresh the web browser. Uh, you can see the input one is changed to one. So now it's triangle. So I have short for the input one. If I short for the input two, you can see that this is input two. And I can refresh. Uh, you can see now the input one is become zero and the input two is become one. This is triggered. And also I can track the input six. This is channel six refresh. As uh, you can see, as uh, this is six channel is become one. So this is how to send the HTTP command by yourself. You just send the command according to this protocol. And uh, change the IP address and the command and the password by yourself. So you can use this stream, just uh, this three command. Uh, you can integrate to your own software by the HTTP post the mode. Uh, you can integrate with the web page or your web service or your own application. So it will be very easy. Uh, just like we can, just like uh, we can uh, go to this web page uh, also you send HTTP command by itself uh, so you can see the relay 1, 2 is on relay 1, 2 is on and turn off okay this is how to use HTTP command to send by yourself uh, for integrate your own software thanks for watching